John, uh, how did you get to become like the world's fastest talking man? Well, when I was 12 years old, growing up on Long Island, there was a cerebral palsy fair a few blocks away from my house, and they announced that they would donate $2,000 to a cerebral palsy for anyone that broke a Guinness record. So first I wanted to ride the roller coaster at Coney Island, so I called Coney Island, and they said, hey, kid, take a hike, you're 12 years old, we are not going to let you strap yourself into the cyclone for two weeks straight. So I went home and I started flipping through a book and decided that I wasn't going to eat a car, swallow lead pipes, so the next best thing was to lock myself in a room and teach myself how to do the fast talking. I also had five sisters, so to get a word in edgewise was a little bit of self-defense. <laughs>